Meghan confidently shined in a tight waist Zara play suit and chonky hoops. The Duchess of Sussex looked effortlessly glamorous on Prince Harry's birthday. The Duchess of Sussex is not disappointed with her style choices for her appearances at the Invictus Games with Prince Harry this week. Continuing to showcase her penchant for neutrals, Meghan stepped out in a gorgeous belted play suit. And coordinating Celine Blazer in soft acre shades, which marked her husband's 39th birthday. Despite her summer wardrobe including several gorgeous designer staples, Meghan turned to high street store Zara for her latest look. Her affordable play suit features silver buttons down the front, pockets, a tied waist, and a structured collar, but it is sadly a past season by, according to Ad Royal for Shianpolis. Meghan added Saint Laurent black leather mules and accessorized with gold jewelry, including a Leo Zodiac pendant necklace from Brilliant Earth and chonky hoop earrings from Bottega Veneta. To finish off her summer ensemble, Meghan kept her beauty blend soft and natural with dewy skin and dark lashes, styling her raven hair in two soft waves that fell past her shoulders. Friday saw Harry and Meghan watch Germany vs Poland in the sitting volleyball. Hand out medals to the winners of the cycling fixtures and even enjoy a private birthday lunch to celebrate the Duke's birthday. While fans are used to seeing the Duchess looking flawless, it may come as a surprise to hear she has not had her entourage of stylists. Hairdressers and makeup artists join her for her trip to Germany as most royals do while on tour. Instead, Meghan has been responsible for her own hair and makeup over the past few days. Following her speedy one-hour outfit change after traveling from Los Angeles to Germany on Wednesday, the Duchess of Sussex's press team explained, she did her own hair and makeup and will do her own the entire trip. Meghan has tried to ensure the focus is kept on the Invictus Games, stepping out in a series of neutral-toned clothes. From her silky fawn-hued blouse from Legends to her white polo Ray Florence sweater vest and her oats toward shorts. This comes after she admitted on her tell-all Netflix to accuseries. That she deliberately steered clear of bright colors during her time as a working royal. Most of the time that I was in the UK, I rarely wore color, she began. To my understanding, you can't ever wear the same color as Her Majesty if there's a group event. But then you also should it be wearing the same color as one of the other more senior members of the family. Day 7 of the Invictus Games is underway and we're expecting an imminent appearance from Prince Harry and Meghan. The couple will watch the sitting volleyball, archery, and cycling fixtures this morning, followed by the sitting volleyball finals this evening. It comes after Harry treated his team to an intimate pre-birthday dinner out at a restaurant in central Dusseldorf. The family meal took place in the main restaurant and Harry was very generous, and tipped very well. Get all the exclusive details here including what they drank and ate. Our reporter Isabel Casey is live on the ground and bumped into them as they were leaving. It's a big day for Harry, as he's also celebrating his 39th birthday. While we wait for the Sussexes to arrive, take a look at some of Harry's best life photos so far. Including some very sweet ones from his childhood. Harry and Meghan are arriving to a rousing rendition of Happy Birthday for the Duke. The crowds are getting into the celebratory spirit and are even dancing the conga. Harry's blowing kisses and says the little boy seated next to him has got the moves. He's being given a birthday gift from Team Columbia, coffee and a satchel, most likely the first of many presents today. It's a thumbs up from Prince Harry, Although he looks a little relieved the attention is now focused on Germany versus Poland competing in the sitting volleyball. The Sussexes are making their way to the track to greet the sitting volleyball competitors and fans. More photo ops for a lucky few, including the Poland volleyball team. Your daily reminder that Megan has traveled to Germany without a glam squad or stylist. She's been doing her own hair and makeup for her high profile appearances. Harry and Meghan are heading outside the Merkerspiel arena to quickly meet fans before their next fixture, cycling. We wonder how many times he'll hear happy birthday. Prince Harry's left his two young children Prince Archie and Princess Lilibet at home in California. Comma but he's showing his fatherly instincts at a prize giving ceremony. Harry is lifting the daughter of UK cyclist champion, David Jarvis, over a barrier so she can be reunited with her dad and see his gold medal up close. The little girl Sophia is with her mum Stephanie Jarvis, who is also coincidentally celebrating her birthday today. Stephanie's admitted she thought David had forgotten her birthday, 
but he's just gifting her a silver love heart pendant necklace now. As a child, I joked that I should be a princess because we share a birthday, Stephanie tells. Speaking of her husband's win, she says, this is David's sport. I knew he'd be strong. But for him to go and win gold and get the fastest time overall, it's incredible. I'm so emotional. I'm just really proud of him. Thank you for watching. If you like our video, would you please help us like, share and subscribe our channel. Wish you happy to see our videos, thank you very much.